How to make a pinhole camera. Make the simplest camera ever invented using just a lightproof box, a hole, and paper. You will need one clean 7-inch tall oatmeal box, heavy foil, a crafter utility knife, matte or flat black spray paint, black contact paper, a number 16 bead threading needle, epoxy glue, white glue, a handful of cotton swabs, electrical tape, a ruler, fine sandpaper, photo emulsion paper, a completely dark room, and a place to develop your film. Optional, one aluminum soda can. Step one, clean out the inside of the oatmeal box, making sure no oatmeal dust or oats are left inside. Step two, remove the plastic top and bottom from the oatmeal box. Step three, add a bead of white glue around the lip of the bottom and reattach it. This will ensure no light comes in through the seam. Step four, spray paint the inside of the oatmeal box with black spray paint and let dry. Repeat if necessary. Also, spray paint the bottom. Let it dry. Step five, while the top is off, add contact paper to the box top. Then spray paint it black. Make sure it will still fit on the box. Step six, use the craft knife to cut a three-sided rectangle a long door about 1.5 inches wide and half an inch tall into the side of the box. Make sure the rectangle is roughly centered and parallel to the bottom of the container. Step seven, cut a 2.5 inch square out of heavy aluminum foil. For something sturdier, you can cut the square from the side of the soda can, but be careful, the edges will be extremely sharp. Step eight, using the number 16 needle, Carefully poke a hole into the center of your aluminum square. Then sand the hole on both sides with the sandpaper to remove any burrs. Step nine, re-drill the same hole and re-sand it a second time. Be careful not to touch the hole with your fingers as natural oils from your skin can clog the hole. Step 10, dab a little epoxy on the edges of the pinhole plate with a cotton swab, making sure not to come anywhere close to the pinhole and place the plate on the inside of the oatmeal box with the pinhole centered in the rectangle you cut earlier. Step 11, add a strip of electrical tape on all sides of the plate to further secure it into place. This will also help it from sliding as the epoxy dries. Step 12, add a piece of tape to the outside of the small door that can keep it closed, then put on the box top. Step 13, when you're ready to load your pinhole camera for a shoot, Take it into a completely dark room. While in the dark, remove the photo emulsion paper from its wrapping and place it inside the pinhole camera, curved around the edge, emulsion side facing the pinhole. Step 14, close up the box tightly, making sure no light can get in. Step 15, to shoot a scene, point the doorway toward your subject and open the door for about a 20 second exposure. Step 16, after you've taken your shot, return to a dark room and remove the paper, making sure to put it back in the lightproof bag it came in. Step 17. Either develop the photo yourself in a dark room, or take your paper to your local high-end camera shop to develop it for you. Step 18. Don't forget to eat your oatmeal. Did you know? The Chinese mentioned pinhole cameras as far back as 500 BC.